This is Army Ranger School. A ranger is brave, strong, and ready for battle on land, sea, or air. A ranger has to keep himself alert at all times. He must be physically strong and a well-trained soldier. A ranger is always ready to defeat the enemies of our country. And under no circumstances does a ranger leave a fallen comrade. My unit went to Somalia to try to round up the warlord that was responsible for the death of some United Nations. The mission was the events of Black Hawk Down. We had just a couple of hundred men surrounded by 10,000 armed Somalis. And while I was there, when people were being killed to my left and to my right, God gave me a sense of peace. And immediately afterwards, I was started to become very sure that God was leading me to the ministry. When it got really, really bad, and they were saying, God, I don't know how much more of this I can take. Army Ranger Jeff Struker followed God's leading. He's a Southern Baptist Army chaplain. He tells Army Rangers about Jesus. He has kept his vow to never leave a comrade behind. Our God, you see these guys that have their hands raised before you, and I pray that you would radically meet them right here where they're at, God, that you would change them and make them new men from the inside out. And every day for the rest of their life, they would know a hope that is absolutely certain. I know Jesus Christ is real because he's changed my life. Most of them will go a couple of days um, with no food. Some of them have gone as long as three days without any sleep whatsoever. My goal has been to meet them when they're at their absolute worst. The more difficult the circumstances, the more receptive the average person becomes to issues of faith. It's so they don't have TV and an internet connection and all of the things that were keeping them from thinking about God. Eric Talamontes was one ranger that listened to Jeff when he talked to him about Jesus. I called my mother and I told her that I, I did get baptized and she started crying. She's like, I, was, I always wanted you to get baptized and you just, before you never listened to me. And I was like, well, I'm sorry I didn't listen to you all, but now I know you try, what you were trying to preach, so. <laughs> You're buried at the Lord in baptism, raised to walk a new man. Specialist Talamontes is just one of 30 soldiers Chaplain Struker has baptized in the last year soldiers who will graduate from ranger school and then head off to war. Right now, most of these guys have already been to combat. And those who haven't been to combat in Iraq or Afghanistan, they know that they're going very soon. There's an urgency for me to share the gospel of Jesus Christ with them. When I see these guys and what they go through and what they're willing to do to serve their country, it absolutely blows me away. They're my heroes. And I can't think of a greater privilege than to be able to be a pastor to a group of my heroes.